up you guys welcome back to my channel for those that are new here hi my name is Rochelle and I like to make thrifting and fashion videos along with a little bit of beauty and just sharing my life with you guys over here on my little corner of the internet for today's video we're going thrifting I'm at a Goodwill store that I haven't been into and honestly probably a few months so I'm excited to get in there because it's gonna be all new stuff I love it when it's been a while since I've been into one, you know? I have a few things on my wish list that I just jotted down in the car really quickly before I go in, but if I don't find them, it's okay. But this is what I'm kind of like thinking of. I've been really into jewelry and jewelry stacking. There's some girls on my Instagram that have just really given me a bunch of inspo to just like wear as many necklaces, rings, bracelets as possible. And also some like kind of statement pieces of necklaces. I've also been noticing like big chunky, like pendanty type necklaces. So I'm kind of keeping on the lookout for one that I might like. I don't like all of them, but sometimes I think that they are pretty cute, especially layered. I'm also looking for just workout gear in general. Since I've been working out recently, I joined a gym. I've been loving it and I feel good when I look cute at the gym. So I'm kind of like looking for workout stuff in general. I am into sneakers. So like workout, tennis shoes, but also just like sneakers in general. Plus it's going to be the upcoming cold weather season. So the sandals will be going away, which is sad, but kind of like boots and sneakers are on my radar. Just accessories in general, hats, scarves. I love accessories. I feel like accessories really like make an outfit pop. So I'm just kind of like always looking for that to be honest. And then also I am looking for maxi skirts because I think that that's such a cute trend lately. A cute little maxi skirt into the fall time would be great as well. Good for summer and fall, so a transitional piece. All right, you guys, I'm anxious to get in there. Let's go. Here we go. I hope it's not too busy in there. I love it when it's quiet and today is Monday. Let's see if there's any cool jewelry in the case. So far, no. Oh, there's a huge pendant. I'm not sure what that silver thing is, but it might be a belt, which might be kind of cool. All right, just walking in, I went through all the jewelry and then the go backs, because they're right at the front here of the store and there's tons of go backs. I feel like sometimes there's some really cute stuff in there. So this is what I found. This little shell cuff bracelet, kind of expensive. These little like dangly earrings in silver. And then there's also a gold one. Um, there's also these fun little like Western looking like earrings. I like these ones, I think the best. I also found this fun chunky bracelet. $4.99 though, and I don't wear that much red, but I do like the style. I just wish it was like black or white stones or like fake stones. I feel like, I'm pretty sure this is a money clip, which is awesome. I feel like I could definitely use that. So I'm gonna get that for sure. And then here's the gold dangly ones. I'm gonna put them at the bottom of my cart too so they don't fall out of this area. The music is really loud in here today and I don't wanna get a copyright infringement so I think I'm gonna do a voiceover for us this video so sorry about that you guys but I don't want to get copyrighted all right first off I found this cute little scrunch top I think it was a like mini dress I thought it could be good as a pool cover or just in the summertime I also found these cute black Levi's you guys know I'm a sucker for Levi's denim I also ended up finding this really pretty cutout lace black dress that was really beautiful. So hopefully I'll try that on. Just this little pink hoodie I was thinking for the gym because I like to wear bright colors at the gym for some reason. And then I found this maxi. I don't know how to feel about it. I kind of like it, but I kind of don't at the same time. So we'll see on that one. I've really been wearing a lot of my skirts and dresses in my wardrobe lately, so I've really been trying to find more. I've actually been on the hunt for a zebra print one, but I didn't like the flowers at the bottom and still haven't found the perfect zebra print skirt or pants. I thought this was really cute, though you guys know I'm a sucker for beading. That was really fun if someone was going to like Hawaii or somewhere tropical, but nothing in the skirts today, unfortunately. Next up, I ended up heading over to the shoes to see if I could find anything good today. I've been really not getting very many shoes lately. I thought these were pretty cute, but I probably won't end up wearing them, but just figured I'd show you guys the ones I like. Saw these Adidas, are those called Superstars? I didn't have a pair, but 
Oh, these ones are cute too. These are, uh, I don't remember. Are they Birkenstocks or maybe they were like Clarks or something? They gave me the clog style that's been really in. These were also a really nice pair of shoes. I have almost an exact same pair. As far as tops, I found this blue workout top and look at these really fun printed, I think they were Lucky Brand sweaters, the blue and the red. I just thought they were such beautiful prints with a zip up. So those could be cute for the gym as well. Next, I headed over to the blouses to see if I could find any fun kind of like scarf prints or anything fun and casual. These were a few that caught my eye, but I didn't end up grabbing, but I thought were fun to show you guys. You guys know I love Harley Davidson. This wasn't my personal favorite style, but when I find Harley Davidson, I usually like it. And then this was such a cute little beaded bag. I thought I could put some like coins in it. I have been looking for bombers. This isn't exactly the style I like, but bombers have been really in. In the housewares, I found these really beautiful neutral set of bowls. And then this was a nice little Starbucks cup, but I couldn't find the top, so I left it behind as well. I did recently declutter a bunch of my cups though. So I have been on the hunt for some new glasses and I found this, which was perfect. They were just really simple and brand new set of four and they were only $3. So I got that. Then I went to the try on room and I thought this was a nice little corduroy jacket. I have one that's really similar though. So I didn't end up picking it up, but it was nice. This shirt did not fit clearly, but would have been cute and kind of like girly. And then I also liked the print of this funky little dress, but I didn't end up grabbing it either. But I did think that the print was really fun for the rest of summer. Here is the zip up uh, red hoodie. I liked this one and the blue one, but I didn't want to get both because I felt like it was unnecessary. So I was trying to figure out which print I liked better. I actually really did like the red, even though I don't wear a lot of red. I feel like I look decent in red. So I'm going to try to start say like changing that this one on the hanger I liked better but then when wearing it I just think the red looked so much better on me but that one was also really cute and then I do have a few upcoming uh, weddings that I will be attending so I've been trying to find a more formal dress these ones were all kind of form-fitting this one was like a bodycon type style which I've noticed have been slowly coming back which I was excited about. And then this one was striped. I thought it was really cute on the hanger, but for some reason on, I didn't like the top of it right there where it has the like black chunk at the top. So I didn't end up getting either of these. And then this is the lace one that I showed you in the very beginning. This one was tempting, but I ended up putting it back as well. All right, you guys, I found so much stuff. Oh my God, this person's driving like a maniac. And I didn't go too overboard. I gotta go run some other errands and then we'll do a haul. I just got home. I had a little bit of food, raviolis. Butternut squash raviolis or are so good, you guys. They're like sweet from the butternut squash, so yummy. I put away all the jewelry at the last second except for, I'm pretty sure this is a money clip. I could be wrong. Oh, is it a roach clip? This is, that was my second time. <laughs> Either this is a money clip or a roach clip. Either way, I like it. <laughs> Comment down below what this is. I don't think it's a hairpin, but it very well could be a hairpin. I'm gonna use it for my money. <laughs> it was 99 cents. I also got these little cups right here and they're just basic cups. I really hated the shape of my previous glasses and I've hated them for years and I don't know why I didn't just get rid of them and get new ones. <laughs> But these ones are just like super basic glasses. These were like $2.99. That's the only housewares I ended up getting. And then for clothes, I did get a few cute things, you guys. I did end up getting the Lucky Brand zip up hoodie sweater right here. I think it's very cute. It's like definitely worn. You know, like faded color. It's not really vibrant, but I actually kind of like that. Like almost Asian looking floral pattern. It was $6.99, I think. Yeah, $6.99. I don't have that many red hoodies. And like I said, I was looking for like these zip up kind of sweaters. So this was actually something that was on my wish list. Ooh, I have something exciting to show you guys. I got this. And I was so stoked. This is from the brand 12th Tribe, which I actually follow on Instagram. I think that they're kind of like more of like a boutique type store. And they're very like um, bohemian, kind of like hippy dippy kind of style. 
and I've never actually found 12th tribe when sh thrifting. So I was so excited to find it. And these were new with tags, which was amazing. This was $6. Here's the little tag right here. And they actually still sell this um, on their website for like $75 or so. I don't think it is silk, but it's a very soft material. It feels kind of like silk. I'm not too sure if this is an actual like robe or a kimono. In the photo online, it looks like it kind of almost tied it like it could be worn as like a tie. But like the way that they styled it in the photos, I feel like you could like potentially wear it wrap dress like this kind of thing. I'm not sure, but look at how stunning the color is. On the back, it's a different material, but it kind of like fits into the same color scheme. It's absolutely stunning. I love it. I think it's so cute and very boho. Sometimes I like get really into the boho stuff and then sometimes, I don't know, but I feel like I've been kind of into it lately and I think it's pretty, beautiful fall colors. I got these, I've been working out and looking for workout clothes and these ones are just like kind of compression black leggings. Tala, never heard of it. For the gym ski. And I also got this for the gym ski. Just a little Shein workout tank top thing. Like a cornflower blue, almost purple, but it's more blue. It's coming off a little bit more purple on camera. Are you okay? Are you okay? And then the last thing I ended up getting was this really fun um, Roxy. I think this is old Roxy. Like green, Kelly green, I love Kelly green dress and it's a maxi and it looks like it has some little halter ties straps on the front here to tie stretchy chest material and then it is super long with this really fun little stripe pattern and tiered thing going on. So I love this. I think it'll look cute with sneakers. This is also something I can transition into the fall since it is nice and long and a maxi length. So it wasn't a maxi skirt that I was looking for, but I found a maxi dress. So that was great. That was everything. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you so much for coming thrifting with me today. And um, I'll see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye.